Welcome back to the Pittsburgh Business Virgin. We are here today with Marcy Rigby of Clear Channel. Um, Marcy, let, let's pretend I'm I'm starting my own business. Uh, I'm looking to to get word of mouth out. How how would I determine what's the right station? What's the the right demographic? The right time frame to sh to show my ads? Correct. How, how would I do that? Um, and that's a good question because that's what I deal with every single day. People saying, how do I do this? I'm new and I, I'm not sure. Um, I think the proper steps are, you know, to meet with a client in person. I do a client needs analysis so I can learn who their target audience is, what it is um, they're selling. So I know their product. I consider myself more of a partner with my clients as opposed to just an ad rep because it benefits me to give you the right advice so that you know going into a campaign or when you have to make that decision what format you're going to look at, whether it be radio, TV, print. I, I always say... and But if people don't see ROI... And you need and return it, on right? investment. So, Absolutely. I mean, you're, you're not going to so lead you, people astray because it's no, going to be a short-term no, I, relationship. I, don't, I right? never intend to lead people astray. Yeah. Sometimes campaigns yeah. don't always work for numerous reasons, which I can get into that later. But specifically, it's really common sense. If you're targeting you know, an audience that's men, 45 plus upper income, disposable um, income, highly educated professionals, then I know I have a pretty good format that's going to meet that, yeah. who's going to match that. So, you know, once you dissect all of those criteria so and qualitative of the audience, then you're more educated and you know how to make the best decision for your company. Well, let's talk about that because I think it, I think it's really important, and this is one of the and, – and full and fair – uh, we work with you. Correct. We, yes, we do you. advertising with 104.7, obviously. Yes, you do. Um, you have quite, I would call call it a portfolio that you can bring to the table. So a lot yes. of, I think a lot of times people are, there, there's two misconceptions. One, I'm going to get sold and I'm never going to see the person again. Which, which they does, don't get it because that does happen, unfortunately, yeah. in this business, and that's why you have to really well, partner with somebody who you trust. Yeah, and, let me let me let me rephrase. Why we work with you is because you you understand the the long term nature of a relationship. In other words, hey Brad, you're going to spend money, but it's going to I want it to really truly work for you because work, yes. I want the next deal, the next Correct. deal, the next deal, right. and I want to so work win, with you for, win a while. for everybody. Absolutely. But let's talk about the the portfolio. So you got ninety six one kiss, kiss, which is young gals. Um, you know, it's it's more female targeted, yeah. eighteen to thirty four. You got one zero four seven, which is sort of the news talk. Yeah, news talk, right wing, correct. People and it's, that but absolutely despise, but behind the camera are <laughs> our local communists. And it's one of the top rated stations. <laughs> and in one Pittsburgh. of the one top rated stations. <laughs> go figure, bud, communists. And it, it um, is uh, the adult, you yeah. know. Really, Glenn Beck, 35, Rush 64, yeah, you skews mail. The pirates yes. bring a lot in too, right? And the pirates. And the, home, and the pirates are the pirates. Yeah. Are killing your race. Uh, 105, <laughs> 1025, which is sort of DVE. 102.5 WDVE, yeah. which is the king of all radio in Pittsburgh. In, in Pittsburgh. It's, you know, the heritage, and it's also the home of the Pittsburgh Steelers. Go Steelers. Not, go Steelers. They're, they're good for your ratings. 94, <laughs> 94.5, which is that sort of contemporary. Adult contemporary, yeah. 3WS. People often say, oh, that's the oldie station, but it changed yeah. formats as far as the music feel. Three, maybe four years ago, it's more adult contemporary. And, and then you got 105.9, which is sort of the 18 to 34 the young X, males. Yes, and it's also which, the flagship. Which, by the way, I still listen to even though I'm 36 now. Just but that's FYI. so you're... You're yeah, making right. our demo larger. Okay. That's great. We appreciate that. And uh, ni uh, 970, which is your AM ESPN, ESPN sports, radio. sports Radio, and it simulcasts the Steelers, the Penguins, and the I Pirates. think that's really important for people to understand that when they sit down and they're, and they're formulating that game plan, that you're going to sit down, you have the demographics and the portfolio for all these radio stations. Yeah, we run you know the gamut as far as you know if you're – a female target for, for young young mm -hmm. women, or if you're looking for young men, older professionals, we really do have something that will match that. Um, so we're very, we have a very rounded, you know, 
cluster of stations, six stations, and we do reach a wide percentage of the market here in Pittsburgh. If someone is sitting out, actually, you know what? Hold that thought. I want to do an extra segment here because I want to talk. I want to. I want to pick your brain on if someone's sitting there, whether they're about to start a business, mm -hmm. or um, they already have a business. What is? What are your guidelines? How much money should they be spending? But I also want to get a feel for why people should should be sitting down with you and sort of get a, a, a flavor for what that looks like. I, I want to go okay. a little bit deeper on that because sure. I, I think that's really... It is very important. Very key, very important. And uh, come back for segment three, and we're going to dive deeper on that with Marcy Rigby. And Marcy is at... Uh, she can be contacted at 412-919-8575 or Marcy Rigby at clearchannel.com. All right, come back for the next episode. Thank you.